Hello good people, I'm Jason with Squad Car 37 and you are watching another episode of Micro Tutorial Tuesday, where I put a minute and 37 seconds on the clock and share with you a music tip or life lesson. This week, I'm gonna share another life lesson. And this is all about being social on social media. Let's get started. But first, I'm gonna get a car wash and then drive this awesome front end loader. Just kidding, I can't drive one of those things. So I love that we live in an age where we can create a movie on our phone, we can collaborate with artists from around the world and write a song and never even be in the same room together. I love the idea that we can find interesting content and share our own content online. But there is one thing I think sidetracks us from productivity on social media. I'm talking about vanity metrics. These are the numbers on your social media pages, your likes, your subscribers, your followers. All these things can be very distracting. Now this may sound counterintuitive if you're a creator, but I'd suggest not focusing on your metrics. Instead, focus on having a blast creating. Share the best content you can make and keep it coming. And don't let a dislike or a negative comment discourage you from sharing your next creation. Also, be social on social media. Find like-minded people with like-minded interests. Reach out to them and see if you can collaborate or share ideas. I've done this with music projects and had a ton of fun and it's been super rewarding. <laughs> So to recap, don't let your numbers get in the way of your progress. Build it, make it awesome, share it, and the numbers will follow. And be social on social media. Well, I'm pretty confident I was able to stay within the 1 minute 37 second mark, which I'm excited about. I need to head home though, because I promised number one I would watch old Squad Car 37 vlogs with him. And that's why I'm going to sunny LA, where I'll be happy. So number one, you really like watching these old Squad Car 37 vlogs? Oh yes, I think they're absolutely fantastic. Hey, number two, where are you? Are you okay? I never wanna see you again. Well, that doesn't make any sense. I know, right? If he really didn't wanna see you, why would he FaceTime you? Here's a bonus life lesson for you. You know those pesky door pops when somebody parks a little too close to you and they bump into the side of your door with their door and it leaves a dent? Here's a tip to minimize the chance of that happening. So choose a parking spot that is far away from other cars. And also, try to find one next to a curb. The curb essentially blocks one side of your car from door pops and the distance from all the other cars minimizes the chance of other people parking next to you, and thus minimizing the chance of a door pop. So there's a bonus life lesson door pop tip for you, free of charge. <laughs> 